Such a movie is Tom Prendival's On the Front Line with the G-Force, a prophetic tale of political corruption which foretold with chilling accuracy, okay, splattergun guesswork, the rise of our latter-day tribunal culture. We would further recommend that the four members of the Gardaí corner in question be put on the 40 days probation with a recommendation that should any breach of conduct occur, no matter how small, the Ooh, penalty look, John will be automatic dismissal from the force. Ringo is a maverick Dublin detective and member of Dublin Special Forces Unit, the G-Force. The G-Force have an arch nemesis in the form of Rick Parfit from Status Quo. Ho <laughs> ho! As you know, my name is Hawk Miller, and uh, I'm into drugs, prostitution, fraud, computerised thieving, and, and general, general uh, obscenities like that. Way to go, Rick. Oh, and a sidekick, Ronnie Wood, from the Rolling Stones. Take you carefully, Frank. Things are rough at the moment. Rough at the moment. You look rough, don't you? I meet the dogs. <laughs> <laughs> While the good account is upped by an emaciated Phil Collins. It's an old law. You, you, can't, you can't book anyone for your night in the public because urine has got no rateable value. Now, if, he, if he was pissing something other than urine, you could book him. But it's highly likely that he'd be pissing anything other than urine. You know? Now forget about it. Go home. Actually, Baddy Hawk Miller is played by ex-Catholic priest Father Fran Heaton. I'm not joking. Father Fran swapped his satan for a pair of sweaty leathers a few years back and teamed up with satanic biker rocker Judas. My name is Judas. I've been in, you know, the big, you know, deal of cocaine, heroin, speed, and anything, guns, you now robbing limousines and selling them. Well, they're not called Judas Priest but I bet they'd like to be. In G-Force, Father Fran is a kind of John Gilligan, but with stupider henchmen and a taste for pantomime porn. Oh, Rocky, baby, so am I. You must tell me more about your work as a deep sea diver. Oh, how interesting Celsius. Well, you know, the water is really cold. It's wet and blue. Now, G-Force has been stunning viewers, and I mean in a wreck the head kind of way, on cable channels all across the US. And when it was shown on the Cable Link channel last year, viewers became convinced that it was a test broadcast for a new rehabilitation station for inmates of the Central Mental Hospital. Break into the city mental asylum in search of tranquilizers. And you do get the feeling that the people who made this movie aren't quite all there. Use the door, the door, use the bloody door. Oh, forget it. Ringo's sidekick detective has a quirky affectation. He likes to quell the baddies with a belt of the innards from a Hallmark card. To one who bears the sweetest name and has a lust of sugar saying, the greatest friend I ever had, long life to her, but there's no other can take the place of my dear mother. A mother's love is a blessing. How am I pray today? You know what it says in the book of Revelations? There'll come a day when you can't buy, sell, nor trade unless you're wearing the mark of the beast. Yes. And I promise the you... The mark of the beast will be like, just like a barcode. My God, if you ever bring that into the city, Chief McGart, I promise you the G-Force will blow up City Hall and you and everyone else in it. And that's a promise. But it culminates in a shootout caper on Dolly Mount Strand that reminded me of a game of cowboys and Indians I once played in primary school. Mm. Yee-haw! Oh, we ran out of caps too. It was great. Now, G4 predates our spate of Irish crime movies, Ordinary Decent Criminal, Veronica Guerin, by over half a decade. And some might argue it's more convincing than both of them. Yeah. We won ourselves a lottery. Oh, nice oh yeah. One. Nice one. Look we at have that. the drugs. We have the drugs. We have it. Pure Coke! Yeah. Oh, I'd say maybe a million pounds, Commissioner. If they're kind of the streets now, we'll keep this ourselves again. Yeah. But at least the cast have the savvy to keep their names off the credits. If you enjoyed On the Front Line with the G-Force, you're going to love the sequel. The what? The sequel? There's a sequel to this? From the people who brought you On the Front Line with the G-Force comes a film of searing insight and massive emotion. I you see this headline, full of drugs everywhere. And you two sitting at the bar when you should be cleaning out the streets. In a city where right was wrong and wrong was right, one man battled a system as corrupt as he was. You are corrupt, sir, and your organization is corrupt. And one with such ferocity that he lost it all. Gringo, you fucked it up again. Starring Tom Brandeville and co-starring all his friends, even the ones he doesn't like. They're calling it Mean Streets Meet Mr. Bean. DCPD.
Dublin City Police Department. Jesus, Mister, is he all right? Yeah, uh, they sure. He's taking a, he's taking a shot. Coming soon to the cable channel.